Hello everyone. Wanted to connect with you right now because I felt very passionate. Uh, not myself, not my ego. Getting all of this out of the way and out of the mix. Um, I ate some mushrooms. And I eat them frequently. I'm not shy about it. Um, I am a mushroom. I know this. <laughs> uh, the mushroom speaks. And to all those out there who don't understand this, um, it's time to wake the fuck up. The mushroom speaks. And if you can shut up and quiet your mind and do the work and listen to it, it will keep unfolding levels of knowledge upon you that will blow your mind. The synchronicities, the psychic abilities, um, your superpowers, to be able to walk into a room and see everyone's thoughts, um, to know who's trapped and who isn't, to see through the magicians. Hmm. Man, I'm, I'm coming to you right now because I have so many family and friends and loved ones, and I'm talking to you too if you're listening to this, that follow everyone and everything. And they all have their own type of bent. You know, they all have their own type of little things they'll bend to and other things that they won't, which categorize them, which makes them uh, fall into a, a category. Stay with me right now if you can. And these categories are just ways to compartmentalize um, for this conversation. Um, but these categories all can be controlled. And I don't understand why you, <sighs> let me just stop cutting the bullshit and lingering. Do you understand that you're God? Do you understand that you're a creator? Do you understand that this world is a matrix? No shit math matches and works with everything. Have you not figured this out? Do you see how science is just a mundane run on and run on and run on and run on into an infinity that will never solve the answer that you will only find out when you go within? Now, there's levels to the within. Yeah, you can find peace of mind through meditation and you can do yoga to help clear your body of your drosh and, and, and open yourself up and feel sensations of your chakras and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. But when it comes down to it, we have to get out of our own ways. And the only way to do that is to take plant medicine. Now I have the sacred ally cannabis with me right here, but this is just an ally for myself. Um, I tune into the ancestor. Everything, everything that I do comes from the ancestor. And the true ancestor is the mushroom. This is the psychedelic that surpasses all psychedelics because all plants, all animals, all of them know that they're going to be eaten by the mushroom. The mushroom is not a mushroom. It's a mechanism for contact. It's a way for us to tune in. And if we allow, there is something speaking on the other side. Hmm. This is going deep now. And, you know, I, I won't go too far because I'm starting to ramble and forget what I was speaking about to begin with. But, I mean, deep down, I just feel you need to stop following people. You need to stop following even me or... A religion or an idea or anything in any movement or new age type of thinking or you know all these things are traps and until you tune in to yourself and you deal with 
your dark shit, your deepest, darkest shit that you've never shared with anyone until you confront that and understand that that deep darkness, that nasty shit that you push away, that you hate to confront, that that is you. Until you understand this and feel this and become one with it, you will never transcend. And you're going to keep regurgitating the same shit over and over and over. And how has the shit worked out? I mean, really look at everything for our, our, our children, our, our ancestors who left behind. How has this worked out? Now, I'm Taino, so I'm speaking for my ancestors, who I see got sold an idea and became trapped when they had it figured out to begin with. My ancestors knew about shamanism. They knew the truth of the plant medicines. Now, I don't want to put any label on who's controlling it, but it's all fads. All this shit is all fads to sell you on the next cure to depression or the next cure to whatever your ego thinks needs to be abolished and cleared for you to be able to continue your process of growth. Man, I'm telling you that there is no growth, that you are the source, and that you must tune in to yourself. You must go inwards. You must stop looking outwards. Stop reading books. Stop looking at all this bullshit. Man. Turn inwards. Quiet the, the quiet up. <laughs> quiet your mind. What you need to do is finally detach from everything you think you know. Finally detach. Like really ponder this. What does it mean to detach? And what's the benefit of detachment? And what's the disadvantage to being detached? Well, I'll tell you one, the benefit is you clear up a lot of space. You clear up so much space of all this shit that you thought was you, you clear up so much space where you even realize that half of the shit was never you and it's all implanted ideas and programs. And you're able to clear it. That's a benefit. Disadvantage, everything you thought you knew, you're gonna find out is gonna, is, is gonna crumble all on top of you. Everything's gonna be broken apart. Everything is going to be demolished. And what's funny is that that everything that's demolished has nothing to do with who I am and who you are down to your core. Beyond all of this. But we're attached. We feel we need to do certain things. We fall into programs which make us susceptible to other attachments. Oh, please don't even get me started. This is why I've become a reverend. This is why I've created Finally Detached. This is why I and the mushroom, when I speak I, it's not my ego, it's the mushroom. I can care less about all this. Please don't read me the wrong way. I love what I do and I love this is the most fulfilling thing I could have ever chosen to do in my life, but I can care less about creating anything or, uh, I, I mean, uh, I'm okay just being free and living on land and not bothering or being a radar on anyone's blimp or being a blimp on anyone's radar <laughs> shall I say but 
this is this is me sacrificing myself so I can uh, I, I don't know what I'm doing all I know is that I'm committing to what I'm doing and I feel what I'm doing and hopefully you feel what I'm saying because there is no time I'm not here to be scary There is no time. Time doesn't exist. So once you understand time doesn't exist and that we live in an eter inter eternal now, like everything is right now, then why are you still looking outside of yourself to reach your next best or to abolish your supposed worst why don't you understand that it's all here right now and that all you have to do is tune in and listen and find a space where you can be quiet and people who will respect that. People who admire your bravery. People who themselves are more and more and day after day stepping into creativity and detaching from themselves guys if you hear my calling please understand that I'm here for you and that I'm gonna keep speaking my truth and I'm gonna keep going deeper and deeper and deeper hmm coming back and just sharing whatever I find and I want to let you know if you're on the same journey or if you're still stuck in processes or if you're just you know a consumer like everyone else instead of a producer consuming everyone's ideas and everyone's vocabulary and everyone's shit still not creating your own trying to heal with other people's stuff not understanding that you're the medicine hmm. this is what finally detached is finally detached is the lifestyle the awakening the knowing that you are the medicine it's not just some sexy lingo or just some flashy thing to say no you are the medicine so at Finally Detach, we are going to supply you with everything you need to harness your medicine. Courses, ebooks, understanding hypnotherapy, learning hypnotherapy for yourself, not just having it run on you. Uh, affirmations, programming your own mind for everything you want. Every little thing, no matter where you're at in your path. Where are you at? Are you stuck? You notice you're still irritable? Okay, well, let's create affirmations for you to become less irritable, to be more in the moment, to breathe, to understand, to be aware, to allow, to forgive. Not listen to other people's affirmations, but create your own. What about the business? How are you getting creative? How are you breaking free? How are you finding new ways to add income that are detaching from old ways of doing things? Are you moving online? Are you creating these layers? Are you giving? 
Are you giving not only to the people, but are you giving of yourself? <sighs> this is what finally detached is. And finally detached is just going to be a place for you to harness this lifestyle and for you to understand the tools that I've gone through myself. Years, 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 years of traveling, of studying, of deep, dark, just times of falling back into old loops. Years of this shit. I'm gonna give you guys everything. Everything. Because it's not me anymore. And I'm flawed. And I do my best to stay out of this the, the, the most I can. But I'm here. I'm ready. I love, I love you. And I'm excited. And I want you guys to stay tuned for more videos of course and I'll come to you like this I'll just speak my truth um, but we got some exciting things coming We've got 10 acres here of land growing out a retreat detached detached finally detached yes 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 we're bringing psychedelics into the mix yes 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 and yes 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 it's all gonna be above board Stay tuned because it's happening so fast. And we're here and we're ready and we're open for medicine men and women to be a part, to grow this beautiful land we have. It's just a, a canvas right now and we can make it whatever we wish. We can come together, create, make music, videos, informational stuff, courses, I mean, we can just share everything that we have gathered through this journey and put it in one space to give to the world. And putting ego aside, I can care less about my face behind it. It's all of ours, man. Let's spread this medicine and let's do it in a way where we don't attach to any labels. We don't attach to any way of doing things we stay detached and this is how we succeed because then we can't be controlled this is us this is taino this is knowledge this is ancestral r.i.p nip you know cut out the middleman wake up wake up I mean, shit, let me drop this nugget on you. You want to really cut out the middleman? Think about your food that you eat. Think about all the food, all the middlemen that are touching that shit. Think about that. Why don't you cut out the middlemen? Because they're putting, they're cutting, they're cutting for their, for their benefit, not for yours. Hmm. Think about your food. And you want to get really wise... What's the middleman? What if the food is the middleman? Because how does everything grow here in this realm? How did all of this greenery grow? How did we come? How did this, all this blossom on this earth? Want to know the answer? That's it. You got it correct. Why don't you eat that? Why don't you stop listening to what everyone says? Wake up to the programs that are run and see that this thing that many of us stay away from and shy away from <laughs> that that is our great mother that is our great father 
that will give us all the nutrients directly hmm that's just a little short snippet like I said I'm high stay tuned for um future fast gonna do some some cool stuff for you guys just to educate and show that you can do it yourself and you can heal yourself if you become finally detached hmm <laughs> Whatever. I love you guys.